Hello again from my front porch. See, it's a little different. I had to push the little button. It's right there. You can't see it, but I can see it. it's a red button right there. I had to push it because I'm still using the tripod thing. See, I got the, the, the tripod set up right here. You Well, you can't see it because it's underneath what you're looking at right now. But I have the tripod set up and, and you know, with the, the top of the, the, the stick thingy, the, 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 the selfie stick. That was it. Yes, selfie stick. Got that. Uh, mounted on top of the tripod and so now I can just put the phone in the in there and ta-da I can use both my hands yay <laughs> so we'll, we'll see how this where I do kind of like the intimacy of holding it you know because this is what I usually do I hold it like this and I'm trying to talk to you in the on my hand all the time but my arm gets tired anyway you don't care about all that I actually am, am sitting out here it's a beautiful day outside in fact it's a little warm out here I don't know if you can tell but I'm kind of Working up a bit of a sweat sitting out here on the front porch already. Um, and and, and it's, it's almost 8 o'clock at night. And it's like, whoo, still. That's not the way the day started. The day started as a dreary, rainy day. And let me just tell you something. Those of you here in central Iowa who really, really liked it being a nice, warmer day today, you have me to thank because it seems I have godlike abilities Yes, 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 I know. I was as surprised as anybody, but one of my coworkers informed me of this fact because we were having this conversation. Well, I went drove to work this morning and it was a little bit spitty, rainy kind of stuff. And I got there and so I thought, you know what? I'm gonna grab my umbrella because, well, it might be like this all day and I don't, you know, if it's raining heavier, I have my umbrella to walk out with. So I went in, I grabbed my umbrella, or I grabbed my umbrella out of the car and I'm walking in and there's another guy that works here, co-worker, walking in as well, and he looks over and sees the umbrella and says, that was a good idea. That was really smart to grab that because I hear it's supposed to be kind of like this or worse all day. So, oh, it's supposed to pick up raining? Like, yeah, yeah, I hear the, the prediction is we'll probably get some more rain stuff here, yeah. It's like, okay, well, I'm glad I grabbed this. And then as we're walking in, uh, me being Mr. Smart Alec, of course, I said, you know, now that I've grabbed this umbrella, though, I'll bet it's not going to keep raining today. I'll bet the sun's going to come out and it's going to be an absolutely gorgeous, beautiful day. And he laughed and said, that's not the weather report that I saw. I said, okay. Later at lunchtime, I went out and you know what? No rain has not been around for a while. The sun is out and it's a nice, pleasant 70 some degrees, a little bit of a breeze, absolutely gorgeous, beautiful day. Hello. That was me. I did that. <laughs> And when I came back from lunch, I ran into this same coworker uh, who was, who was I, I don't know if he was coming or going to lunch, I don't know. But I ran into him outside there and we, were, we got to talking about how beautiful the day turned out to be. And I reminded him what I had said and he said, wow, that's impressive. You have godlike abilities. <laughs> and I was like, no, I, well, but now that you mention it, hmm, I, maybe there's some truth to that. Because, I mean, today there was... I took, I carry my umbrella and the sun comes out, no rain. Other days, if I want it to rain, all I got to do is go wash my car. I, I'm, no joke. Wash my car. Next day, always rain. Oh, not always. Sometimes it's the same day that I wash my car that it rains. <laughs> but, but I just, I have these abilities. <laughs> Uh, okay, well, anyway, I'm, obviously, I'm, uh, that's, that, I'm joking about that, but I got to be serious about some other abilities. I got to get serious about my book writing abilities. See, I got the contract for my book from ATD, and uh, in order for them to have my book all done and published and ready by next year's uh, ATD conference uh, in, in uh, San Diego in next May, in order for my book to be published and ready to be in the bookstore, the final deadline for my manuscript has to be by the end of this October, which sounds like a long way away, I know. But trust me, it is, it is not as long as you might think. <laughs> and even worse, they don't say just the final manuscript has to be done by then. They also want 50% of it to be done by the end of August. Now, that's only... Two months away and then at the end of August end of October is another only two months away so excuse me so they want me to write a approximately 500,000 page five page no no 500,000 word book in four months and uh, I have 60 to 70 interviews that I have to conduct <laughs> 
to incorporate into my book. Yikes! Okay, see this is the, everybody says, it's so cool that you're writing a book. Uh-huh, the people who say that are not really writing the book. That's the problem. <laughs> so yes, it is cool that I'm writing a book, but the problem is now I have to actually write the book. And so, uh, and, and apparently I have to get busy on it. Uh, I, I, I need my godlike skills and abilities to write the book. That's, what, that's where I need them most. That's <laughs> Uh, I told somebody it's a good thing that I've had somewhat of, a, of an active social life in, in the evenings lately because uh, for the next few months, I'm probably not going to have much. <laughs> Yikes, got so much I got to do with that. So yeah, I got to get buckled down and get going on that. Uh, and of course, my new job position has now officially started and so I'm ramping up into that and I have no clue what the next few months are going to hold in terms of my travel and time stuff. So it's like... Better get going on stuff right now while I know I have a little bit of buffer. I know I have a little flexibility because you don't know what the future holds. So we should get going on that. So, yeah, got to, got to get working on that. And speaking of ATD, they just keep the things churning right along because, <laughs> I kid you not, I got in my email today that they've opened up the RFPs, this uh, request for proposals, to submit to do sessions at next year's conference. <laughs> the one in San Diego. <laughs> I mean, I feel like I just got done with it. Just got done, got my link to the recording or the video of, or the video of my presentation that, that they recorded. I uh, got uh, the, the, the evaluation so that I can see what people said. You know, where they said I said too many ums uh, and all that kind of stuff. But uh, most of them really liked me. You know, out of a scale, on a scale of one to five, uh, they, with five being the best, uh, generally I got about 4.3, 4.4. So, you know, I mean, that's respectable, I think. I'd like it to be higher, of course, who wouldn't? But still, uh, hopefully I'll get a chance next year. Hopefully I'll be able to, because this year they let me do two sessions. Whether they let me do two again next year or not, who knows? But I, I hope they're gonna let me do at least one tied to my book, which will be in the bookstore, if I get busy and get it written. <laughs> it all comes together. Like, like Hannibal Smith on A-Team used to say, I just love it when a plan comes together. <laughs> So anyway, that's, that's, oh man, that's what's going on. I feel, I feel tired already. Do you feel tired already? Because I feel tired already. Uh, anyway, all right, so I'm going to let you go. Oh, uh, by the way, I meant to show you this day, the day outside. I, I want to try something. This is on the tripod here. I want to I give you the little 360 degree tour of the, of the front porch, but let you see outside. I don't know if this is going to work. You're going to be able to see well outside. I haven't done this before, but we're going to give it a try. Are you ready? Okay, now, now. If, if, if you're somebody who gets, you know, sick with motion and stuff, you might want to make sure you're sitting down right now. Hold on to something tight, because here we go. Can you see the nice day outside? I hope you can see the nice day outside. It's gorgeous. It's beautiful. It's amazing. Until you get back to me, and then now not so much. <laughs> Okay, well, yeah, like I said, it's a little bit warm out here uh, because I don't have any of the actual windows open let the air come in through the screens. I probably should have done that. And then you could hear the birds chirping outside. I can hear them outside. But anyway, I'm going to go back uh, in the house or maybe just go back out on my back deck to sit for a while. I got some grapes. Maybe I'll go eat some grapes. Yeah, sounds tasty. So I'm going to let you go, and I will see you next time from my front porch. <laughs>